There we go. Okay, so this is, what's your full name? Bill Blaney. Bill Blaney. Bill Blaney up here in the woods with Ernie. <laughs> Ernie Penner. <laughs> He's with me. Bill Blaney, okay, we're gonna, uh, here, we're sitting, we're not sitting, we're standing by my fire and we're gonna walk up towards that uh, teepee that we found, but um, Bill has- He's a, filming me and I'm filming him, <laughs> it's a beautiful thing. Everybody, <laughs> hey Facebook. <laughs> All right, okay, let's do this. Uh, cool, I want to grab my beer one second. Okay, so I'm using both hands. I got uh, one hand you're still, here. You're still filming. I, I stopped filming. I better. Oh, no, no, I'm going to still film. Just wait. <laughs> Follow me. All right. I'm following my new buddy, Ernie. We're going through the woods here. <laughs> a couple of flashlights. We're looking for a teepee. Is that yes. right, Ernie? Yes. Yeah, my friend, my friend Pretty from dark. my friend from Saskatchewan. She lives in Calgary now. I'm not going to say her name because I'm going to be posting this on Facebook. But uh, well, look how steep this hill is for a couple right. of old men like us. Right? Yeah, we're going to have to work at this, there, Ernie. That's yeah, the way it works, brother. But she dared me to uh, go check it out at night. So good thing I'm not alone. All right, man, we're gonna go up to the magical teepee and we're gonna check it out, man. As long as we don't run any bears up here. That's the thing. Forgot the bear spray. That's okay. I'll smother some honey on my head. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this teepee is right around the corner here. Look at that. Check that out. Oh, cool. Okay, my phone's not catching much right now. We found it. There it is. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Like, what are the chances of the trees falling down like that, right? No, no, no. Somebody, <laughs> I know, I know. somebody built, built it. Somebody's building that. Yeah, truck, obviously. Right? Wow, it's a long way down up here, too. Okay, I'm going to turn off my flashlight for a second. I'm going to show the audience this full moon that we got going on here. Yeah, there it is. Okay, let's see. Turn the flashlight back on and... Uh, we're gonna check out this memorial that you were telling me about. Yeah, let's keep on going. All right. So, so you were saying that um, whose memorial site is this? I forget the guy's name, man, but I looked it up. But there's a name tag on it. Yeah. If it's not been worn out by the sun, we'll be able to check it out. And I did see some solar lights when I was up here I earlier on. Oh yeah, it's working. I can see the solar right around the corner. Oh yeah, it is working. Check it oh, out, man. that's awesome. Okay, so just go straight there, I guess? Is it? That's it. I so, come up here every year and this is this guy's memorial. We're not quite sure how he passed away, but he did. So those stones, are any of the stones that you left here before, are any of them left by you or are they? Yeah, I, I left a couple of stones. People leave stones for them. Here's the name tag for them, but it's buried. Well, here, uh, we're trying to we'll clean it off. You yeah. might be able to see who he is. I forget, but I looked him up. He passed away at a fairly young age. Yeah, it's all been, I forget his name. Damn it. kind of hard to see yeah yeah it's gone but all these stones are left by relatives and friends actually we weren't relatives or friends but we did meet his sister out here one time and uh, she said you know he's a great guy and he loved coming up here quad and, and he died at a fairly young age he was 40 something years old as far as I know wow. well, this tree is for him beautiful tree is starting to grow good and there was another tree over here, but it, it didn't make it. There's another pit right here. Yeah. And that tree didn't make it. But this... Uh, well, the one still is growing pretty good, though. And this is new. Somebody put some hands down here for him. Oh, nice. This is new. This is new. I didn't see this the other years that I've been here. So, but... Uh, yeah, we're we're up way up in the, in the hills here, man. Like... We are in the middle of flipping nowhere. <laughs> exactly. There's a bunch of old cars and uh, old horse trailers up here. Well, there's the there's the moon. Yeah, and there's uh, this 
Well, the first time I came up here kind of freaked me out because I seen like uh, the abandoned vehicle. Right? Gotta check this old Ford out. Come on over here, Ernie, if I can find it. There's this cool old Ford, man, like way back in here. Come on over here. Okay. Come on over here, there's no old Grand Am or something, but there's this old Ford like from 1960. Yeah. Something way back in here. No way. We don't run into a bear. Well, I... I Oh, no, there's two of us and one of them if they do run into one. There, so. there it is, this old Ford back here, man. Well, what's old this? Ford. This is a Grand Am. It's been here, like, I was here like three or four years ago it was here. And I thought, and this is exactly the same shape it's been in. There's still a tennis rocket in it. I don't know how it ends up way the hell up here, but it did. Did you ever check the trunk to see what's inside? Well, I don't, I, I, I didn't want to break into nothing, but check this old Ford out there. I think it's a Ford, if I remember right. Come on, check this yeah, out. Yeah, yeah. Right behind you. Whoa. Now we're going back in time a little bit, eh? I bet you it's like the movie Christine. Have you ever seen that movie by Stephen King? Yeah. This thing probably does come to life every once in a while, and I'm just trying to scare us. <laughs> yeah, look at this old car. What, what is it? Let's check it this out. This is a uh, to Lincoln. I should it? know that I'm a car guy, but what no, is it? What's that symbol right there? That's it. It's a Ford, that's for damn sure. You sure? Yeah, the, win the windows are still in it, never the... Yeah, they are. Anyways. Is it this, open? This, did, this it didn't have nothing to do with the guy who passed away from what I heard, but this car has been here since I was up here like four years ago, man. I climbed up this freaking mountain and found it four years ago. Look at that. There's a... The glove box is open and everything like that inside here. Yeah. That's crazy. It opens. Uh, I'm not sure if I would want to sit in there. I don't know. Probably full of mice by now, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's probably full of mice. Look at that. That's crazy. Yeah. It smells like mice. Oh, yeah, there's mice nests. I'm not sitting in Yeah, there, I can man. see mouse poop. But, I, uh... Yeah, I'm not sitting in that sucker. <laughs> There's critters living in there. Oh, no. I'm going to sit down. Wow, look at the dash. That's where you put the key. That's how you start the car right over there. Not not on the steering wheel, Colin, but... Oh, there it is. See that? Park, reverse, drive. All that. It even says drive. It doesn't say D. It says drive. I have to hold the light back for my camera to see it. But uh, there's a clock right there. Wipers, lights, temperature gauge, everything. Oh, wow. Just sit down. Do it. You'll, you'll go back in time. It is cool. It is cool. That was... My parents had a vehicle like that way back in the day. It's even getting more overgrown now <laughs> compared to like three years ago. Three years ago when yeah. I seen it. Well, let's have a seat. Sit down. Just like it'll okay. trust me. You'll go back in time. I want the mat. You know, I don't want to get mouse shit. Look at all the mouse shit. Okay, better. never mind. Yeah. So that's don't why, sit down. That's why I'm not big on sitting down. No, no. I'm actually I shouldn't have either. But <laughs> oh, you'll be fine. Somebody put the mat there. That could have been me three years ago. You never know. 